everybody. ADDF Toxic here. And, uh, welcome back to my hill. This is the, the 20 by 20 area that I just uh, made just yesterday, actually. Um, it's, it's north of home. Um, home is out that way. That's south, right? Wait, that's west. It's east of home. Um, I don't know what's with these here. Those just look weird. Um, but I am going to be building something here. So just put down a bed. Put down a crafting table, because I'm sure I'll need that. Um... I guess, uh, just get started. There is a desert there with, uh, one of the other villages I found is in that desert. This is about 102 blocks away from that. Whoops, that didn't place properly. Neither did that. And what I want to build here, <coughs> it's a, uh, it's kind of big, and I, um, I wanted to kind of blend in with the forest, which is why I'm making it out of, uh, out of full logs rather than just planks. I'm not even sure if I have enough uh, wood here to finish this. Oh, well, that's not going to help me. So I, uh, last weekend I played a, an adventure map for the first time. Um, uploaded the first episode on, what, Wednesday, I think? This takes a lot of wood. Um, and, uh, Arrival is actually... I said it's pretty much the first adventure map I played. Um, I did play it 45 minutes of another one before that, but I, I couldn't really get into it. Um, it was a uh, wasn't quite what I was thinking of when I decided to play an adventure map. Um, I liked Arrival because it well, one the story was kind of cool. Could have been better, but I, it's I won't complain about it. And, uh, that's not birch leaves. Um, <laughs> and, uh, um, but the other one I played, uh, was a bit more, it seemed to be just playing Minecraft. Like, I think they, I think you're supposed to chop down these trees and craft and all that sort of stuff um, in the other map that I played, and except it had a story to it and it had a world, a, a destroyed world at that, that was already created, and that's not what I wanted to play, so I stopped playing that after 45 minutes. I built that right, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Um, and then, and then found a rival and played that in the evening instead. So that worked out a little bit. That one went quite a bit better. This is the fun part of this build. Whoops.
I may be doing this right. I think I am. Keep on doing my hard work here. And now here comes the night again. Um, so what I'm making here is actually, uh, um, a, I am attempting to make an iron golem farm. Um, because... For what I want to do in this world, I'm going to need a lot of iron. Now, of course, the reason I didn't make an iron golem farm quite a while ago, uh, why I didn't make it until just now, was uh, um, it's because I didn't really like disturbing the villagers in their own villages. This just feels kind of mean, taking these villagers from their from their homes just so that I can use them to make iron golems. Just so I can use them to get a lot of iron. They just seem kinda kinda mean. But I'm gonna take some villagers from one of the two villages I don't visit very often. Um, and, uh, I'm going to put those in, in my farm here. That's one of the reasons I, I put, I'm putting it way over, way over here, way away from home. Uh, the other reason is, of course, because I don't want, um, there's that old spot. Um. It's because I don't want, uh, I don't want this big farm too close to home. I've already got that kind of, that area kind of laid out how I want it to look, so I don't want to wreck that. I know I don't need to put torches at every spot. It just looks kind of cool. Spider. Oh, shit. Forgot spiders can climb. And of course, like I like I said before, I'm I'm uh, making this out of out of just wood wooden logs to make it uh, blend in a little bit more. Damn, I'm one short short. Here, I'll take out every... Two torches short, actually. That's what I'll do with the torches. Four in between. One, two. And there's the phone. I'll let somebody else pick that up. If they want to. Um, what do I want to do next? I guess I'll put a bunch of doors up. And like usual, doors are a pain in the ass because they don't stack.
Okay, there's four doors. So six logs makes four doors. That that works. That's easy enough to remember. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. One. Two. Three, four, should make a chest. Put some of this stuff in. Uh, like that, and that, and that that I don't need at the moment. Now I can take 1, 2, 3, 4. Let's do 6. Wait. 6 logs make a... 8 logs makes... Five doors and two planks. So ten logs still doesn't make it even. I'll just go with the flow. Put two more on this side. That's not where those are supposed to go, though. Friggin' creeper. Three... Four... Five... Six... And then these are supposed to be more logs that I can't seem to damn well place. Oh, the creeper's up there, holy crap! Two, three, four, five, six. Put some more doors down. Hey, that's a way to do it. Just walk on top of the doors. Creeper's in the center. You know what? Screw the creeper. stairs here. Yeah, I don't think I'll have enough, uh, enough logs to finish this like this. I didn't expect to finish this today anyway. Um, just because it's not going to be easy to get those freaking villagers into the, into their cells.
but when I played Arrival, it was, of course, made of 1.3.1. 1, 1. Most of it was reading text files, and, uh, um, it turned out to be mainly reading text files. There, there wasn't much on screen except for the background, which I didn't, I didn't look at very, very much, which I probably should have looked at a little bit more. Um, and on top of that, um, um, there's just not very much new stuff like, like the, all the, the redstone and the command blocks that you can do, that you can use nowadays. Um, none of that was included, which was just a sign of the time. But I still quite enjoyed it. And I'd love to play more more adventure maps like uh, like Arrival. With the with the story that's we know where the story's going. I almost have enough. Idiot. Alright, so I have all sides. I have doors on all sides now. Now you have. I guess next step would be to uh, put villagers in. This is the part where I run out of uh, wood. So I think what I want to do here is... How far did you say to come out? Six? No, just four. Or five. I'm going to make these look like branches. And I am starting on the side with water just to make this trick here myself. Maybe I should, uh... Come on. I want that wood. Make these all face this way. So that there will be kind of my, uh... Villager holding cell. stairs with you anymore. Come on. And I'm just going to light this up. Let's do there, yeah, fall in, great plan, there, there, and there, actually, I'm just going to hex 
take out this piece of wall. Filling these is the part I'm not looking forward to. <laughs> that just sounds like a pain. Actually, I might, uh, I might only put pods on just, just the two opposite ends. Then I can have, uh, eight villagers in each. Here in the way. Give me your wood. this but uh, one video I was watching only had uh, a pot on each side which was a bit different it still keeps the still, still keeps the doors in the center or still keeps the center at the actual center so that's uh, it makes sure that doors on that side are used That's new. <laughs> it's one of the things I was uh, working on last week. That's one of the switches from the minecart track. Um, obviously. Um, and I just put glass over top of it so that uh, um, it can go above ground to... Uh, I was, I was kind of thinking of the, uh, um, the desert village and the other village in the plains just past there. Um, but I'm not sure if I'm going to put track there anymore. And obviously my, my base is hiding a little bit more now. You can still see it pretty good. But it's, uh, it's, yeah, crap. made it look a little bit more natural, and that's the kind of thing I'm going to do on the, uh, the Iron Golem farm as well. Hang on, i got to farm some more trees here. Because I don't have any oak logs at all. Surprised that guy didn't blow up. Let me sleep. And nobody sneak up on me. <sighs> Alright. So I am back at the, uh... The forest golem farm. With the creeper through the trees. Can I can shoot him? Nope. There we go. Give me that arrow back. Ah! I'm not... Wow. Okay. I've tried to run, but I just couldn't. Um... I think I have enough uh, dirt to at least cover this hole. I 
guess those leaves aren't going away because I'm, they're t touching logs. Friggin' zombie. Well, that can work to my advantage, and I guess I'll chop this tree down now that the creeper friggin' blew it up. I was thinking another way that I could have, uh, um, I could have made these walls is by just planting an oak tree. A bunch of oak trees side by side. Because they let you do that. Um, alright, so... That mic looks really high. I guess next is, uh... Make another spawning pad up here, which is gonna be a pain. I can't remember where exactly to put that, though. I'm sitting here trying to, uh, get into bed, and I was just thinking, um, the next step is not to get villagers in there. The next thing I want to do is actually build that tube, um, down below. Below the farm. Um, where should I bring that? Probably not too close to that village. Probably go that way. Um, and it's, it's, uh, the golem tube is going to go underneath, underground, and then I'm going to build a underground path, like usual, I'm going to put a minecart, um, destination, that will go to the collection area. Which will be underground. Uh, here in Enderman. Am I going the right way? I don't think so. Where's that Enderman? Is he underground? Anyways, guys, have a good life.